Hello, my name is Kestitis and today I'll show you how to fix error connection reset. Let's get to it. The error connection reset error occurs when the connection to the website server isn't established correctly. In other words, the website cannot be loaded as the server can't send data to your browser. In most cases, this error is caused by an issue with your client-side internet connection, rather than a server-side issue with the target website. The possible causes for the client-side error are network device issues, VPN interference, antivirus or firewall interference, outdated browser cache, bad proxy, and incorrect or corrupted TCP slash IP configuration. In this video tutorial, I will show you how to fix all of these. While the connection reset error is most often a client-side error, in some rare cases it can be an issue with the website itself. As such, our first step is checking if the website is functional for everybody else. To do so, we can use Website Planet's Is Your Website Down Right Now tool. Simply type in your website's URL and press Enter. If the website server is down, you'll have no choice but to wait until its administrators fix the issue. If you are the website's owner, contact your web hosting provider about the server downtime. Otherwise, if the website is not accessible just for you, let's proceed to the other steps. While a VPN does provide a lot of benefits, such as protecting your privacy and granting you access to region-locked content, it can sometimes cause network connection issues. If you're using a VPN, it's a good idea to temporarily disconnect from it and retry accessing the problematic website. Quite a few network connectivity issues can oftentimes be fixed by simply rebooting your network device or router. All you have to do is unplug your router's power cable, wait for around 10 to 30 seconds, and plug it back in. Another good idea is to try and access the website using another device that's connected to the same network. If the issue persists, try it and contact your internet service provider. Your browser stores data in its cache to reduce loading speeds. Sometimes the information in your browser's cache may be outdated, causing connectivity issues. Clearing your browser's cache might look a bit different depending on what browser you're using. On Google Chrome, simply follow these steps. First, click on the three dots in the top right corner of the screen. Then, navigate to More Tools and click on Clear Browsing Data. From the Time Range drop-down menu, select All Time, and make sure that all the boxes are checked. Then, just click on Clear Data. Having an antivirus and a firewall is essential to keep your computer protected. However, some firewall and antivirus software can incorrectly block perfectly safe websites. If you're sure that the website you're trying to access is safe, try temporarily disabling your antivirus and firewall to see if this fixes the connection reset error. The steps to disable firewall and antivirus services will be specific depending on the software you use. Check the program's documentation if you're unsure how to do it. After trying this method, don't forget to turn your antivirus and firewall software back on. If you leave it off for too long, your computer will be vulnerable to viruses and malware. Proxies protect your web privacy by masking your actual IP address. Unfortunately, a proxy can also experience issues such as overloading or a dead server. If you use a proxy, try temporarily disabling your connection to it. I will show you how you can do it on macOS. Although, if you're using Windows, check out the article in the description for the appropriate steps there. First, navigate to System Preferences, Network. There, select your active internet connection, click Advanced and navigate to the Proxies tab. In the select a protocol to configure window and check all boxes and click OK. TCP slash IP is one of the most important elements that allow a computer to connect to the internet. If the TCP slash IP configuration is incorrect or corrupted, the data your computer sends to the network won't be transferred, causing the connection reset error. So if all else fails, try resetting your TCP and IP settings. 
This action will revert all the changes back to the default settings. Here's how to do it on macOS. First, navigate to System Preferences, Network. Here, once again, select your active internet connection and click Advanced. In the TCP slash IP tab, click on Renew DHCP Lease. And that's it! I really hope that this video helped you solve the connection reset error. If it did, you can let me know by hitting the like button. Let me know in the comments if there are any other error solutions you would like me to cover in a future video. Subscribe to Hostinger Academy for more web hosting content. And until next time, I wish you best of luck in your online journey.